welcome to the barbecue walk of lane in this video i rise to a challenge which all came from a comment i made on the youtube channel chef kevin ashton a guy whose work i admire and whose channel i subscribe to quite by coincidence we found that we lived just 10 miles apart so we got together over a coffee and chatted about all things YouTube. He then issued a challenge for me to cook for him. Who says there's no such thing as a free lunch? Welcome to my patio, Chef Kevin Ashton. Well, Willie, I've seen this area so many times on your YouTube channel and it feels so familiar to me and I'm really glad that you accepted my barbecue challenge. I really like the way that you approach your barbecue cookery and come up with dishes that are a little unique and interesting. And today my challenge to you is to create something on your grill but to make a sauce to go along with it. Okay, right. So what I'm doing, I'm actually doing some chicken breast um, with the skin on and the wing bone in, my butcher calls them chicken supremes um, and I'm going to do those with some baby roast potatoes and a whiskey cream sauce that sounds absolutely delicious wait and see I have some baby potatoes that need to be halved and now that he's here well I might as well give him something to do it seems the sharpness of my knives doesn't meet professional standards. Hey ho, my knives are being sharpened by a pro. With the potatoes halved, add a splash of olive oil. Season with a good grind of salt and a good grind of pepper. Give it all a swirl around to mix. And I'll be using those later. And now for the sauce. First, get the pan hot. The ingredients are butter, whiskey, Dijon mustard, shallot, mushrooms, garlic and chicken stock. What about the cream, Willie? You know what? I've left it in the fridge. Add the butter to the hot pan. When it's melted and sizzling, in goes the shallot. Giving them a good stir to make sure that they don't burn and that they cook nice and evenly. Now we're adding the mushrooms. Making sure that we get the butter coated onto our mushrooms. Now we're going to add 150 millilitres of brown chicken stock and give it a good stir. And now we want that to reduce down. Who's cooking this? You or me? Turn up the heat and the small burner on. In the meantime I'm grating just a half of a clove of garlic. This garlic grater came with a handy little brush. Next in 150 ml of double cream. Come on chef, give it a good stir. It's coming together. Close the lid and let it bubble. Right, I would like to add the, the whiskey to that. Give it a stir for us. Taste it and check the seasoning. Mm. That's really good, but it just needs 
a little salt and pepper. And we'll give it a final stir. So it's off the grill. I'll be using the sauce later. I just pop the lid on. I must say, it's a bit unreal having a pro chef here on my patio. Someone who's cooked for famous names all over the world. So what's you going to think of my food? I really do not know. Should have put the veg basket on. I'll move the veg basket over to make way for the heat shield and grid. I'll be cooking the chicken using indirect heat. To prepare the chicken, brush with a little oil and season with pepper only. Salt draws out the moisture and that is not what I want. Close the lid and let them cook for 5 to 10 minutes. Now add the potatoes. Just listen to that sizzle. I'm turning them skin side down, as the cut side tends to stick to the basket when they first go in. Time to check on the chicken. 74 degrees, that is done. Overcooked chicken and it dries out. I want this chicken juicy. The potatoes have taken on a lovely colour. They're done and they're coming off the grill. I'll just take the chicken off the heat shield and grid so I can remove it. Back on the grill goes the sauce. Potatoes on the warming rack. Thank you. And the chicken is going on the warming rack while the sauce reheats. The sauce is bubbling nicely and it's time to get it all off the grill. And now to plate up. A generous portion of baby roast potatoes. And then the whiskey cream sauce. The aroma coming from this sauce is simply sensational. Garnish with a sprinkling of parsley. And there it is. Barbecue chicken, baby roast potatoes and a whiskey cream sauce. Wow, that looks really delicious, Willie. Thank you very much for inviting me to your barbecue challenge. You're welcome. This looks delicious. Wow, the chicken is cooked just perfectly. Mmm, good sauce. 
Mm. Cheers to your good health, Willie. Well, Kevin, I couldn't let you go without throwing down the gauntlet and issuing my challenge. And that is for you to make a dessert to go with the meal you've just eaten. We'd really love to know what you think of our little get together in this video. All you have to do is click that button. Don't forget to activate and ding the bell and put your thoughts in the comments box below. If you've enjoyed the video, then give us a thumbs up. If you want to see Kevin cooking up a dessert for my challenge, then head over to his channel, Chef Kevin Ashton, and see if he tickle my taste buds. Well, that's all for now. So from me, the dude with the food, the old geezer at the grill, and Chef Kevin Ashton, it's goodbye. Thanks for watching and I'll see you at Kevin's place.